the Shangsheng Islands, the day begins with sunrise on the Yellow Sea. The Shangsheng Islands, also called Shangdao, form an archipelago consisting of 151 islands. Their rich and varied geomorphological features make it China's only insular national geological park. The South Shangsheng Island is the southernmost and the largest island in the group. Tapering off this piece of ocean is an S-shaped curve that bisects the stretch of water into eastern and western halves. This creates a spectacular line between two seas. The curve has two distinct components. The first are deposited rock fragments washed over by the waves, known as pebbles. These pebbles are deposited at the end of the island and form a tortuous ridge stretching into the sea. The other component is the breaker zone. The pebble ridge is connected to the island with a tail extending into the sea. And its end corresponds with the border dividing the Yellow Sea and the Bohai Sea. Therefore, this pebble ridge is often regarded as the natural boundary between the two seas. Many factors created the rock fragment ridge. The South Shangshan Island is long and narrow as the sea currents carrying the fragments reach the island's end. The waves encounter obstacles and slow down, hence pebbles are deposited on the sea floor. Under the effect of the underwater topography, combined with the dynamics of wind and sea currents, the deposits form a ridge that extends southwards for over 2,000 meters long. The ridge is located where the Yellow Sea meets the Bohai Sea. At this special geographic location, waves from both sides constantly clash, which in turn lengthens the ridge. On the side of the Yellow Sea, the shallow water is close to the ridge, which helps break up the onrushing waves and form a glittering breaker zone. It contrasts sharply with the calm surface of the Bohai Sea, as if they are made of different seawater. About six to seven meters below the sea surface, visibility is less than a meter. The clashing waves churn up the seawater to bring up large amounts of plankton, the ample food supply for fish and shellfish. As the sun sets on the Bohai Sea, the waves keep bringing more rock fragments over. In the remote future, the continuing expansion of the ridge might well link up with the ridge of the next island. This natural boundary has become a unique geological feature of the two seas.